Hello YouTube, D. Baudry here. So this uh, Chinese charger, um, I have it set to 66 volts. I've been using it for quite a while um, as 66 volts to charge one of my EVs that's got 16S in it or 66 volts Lion. Um, I didn't think anything of it. I plugged it in, um, left it for a while, came back later and looked on my watt meter which said 73 volts. So I was like, holy shit, that's not good. And then um, yeah, then I pulled up the app, and here's all the cells, and they're all showing 4.4 volts plus. So the low cell in this batch of 16 cells is 4.72, or 4.472 volts. Not good. And that was a charger, um, you know, that basically caused that. But, if I go over into param settings uh, for the BMS, and I'll come up here in a second, there we go. It says over voltage is 4.15 volts. Uh, so it should have cut off when um, any one cell reached 4.15 volts, but here is a double failure. The charger was overcharging and my BMS didn't do what it was supposed to do because it should have cut off C- minus, uh, the MOSFETs that are connected to C-, minus. so that charging stopped when any one cell reached 4.15 volts and it did not happen because as you can clearly see, go back into battery state Here's all my cells, and they're all over voltage. Not good. <clears throat> so don't assume <laughs> that your uh, <clears throat> your charger, say like if this was a 73 volt charger on a 66 volt pack, which is essentially what happened here, even though it's set for 66 volts, something has happened inside this charger. Uh, don't assume that, you know, oh yeah, hey, it's okay, the BMS will catch that, because, um, no, not necessarily. It should, but it didn't. Well, anyway, this is Debodger saying, hey, folks, watch out for the damn SARS virus. Stay healthy. Be nice to each other. Don't be assholes. Talk to you later. Bye.